The APV, based on a Lursen Germany design of PV80, it's about 80 metres in length, about 1,800 tonnes in displacement when it's complete. Its primary purpose is as a constabulary vessel. It has a range of sensors and communication which allows it to integrate well with Australian Border Force and other defence uh, and Navy units and also our international partners and coalition partners. At the moment we have been utilising for the movement of our ship here for the first one. ANI has already invested in high precision vehicles which are able to move mega blocks but also the ship. They can lift more than 1,000 tons and they are controlled by one person and can go all the way up to five kilometers an hour. Thanks to everybody who has been contributing to this, that was just a fantastic job. So the Naval Shipbuilding Enterprise is the collective of organisations and companies that support the delivery of capability to Navy. Collaboration is important to the Naval Shipbuilding Enterprise because it ensures that the products we generate are delivered on time and to cost. It's the first to be rolled out in Osborne Naval Shipyard South. This site will become the hub in Australia for sensitive defence technologies in the maritime domain.